Let me show you the back so you see what it looks like. Definitely the trim. So I'm finally ready to trim my hair. It's been a year since I went to the salon in Harlem to get it trimmed and I think I'm long overdue. My ends are not looking good and I think it's definitely time for a trim. So with that being said, I have decided to trim my hair in its dry, stretch, blow dry stage because this way I want a more precise cut and because you're more you're able to see the damage more when your hair is dry. So let's get started. So for my trimming process I will be using some combs, some clips, and of course hair, hair shears. Um, I bought a brand new pair because I wanted to make sure that these scissors were not used on anything else before. So here they are. I'm going to split my hair in two. And I'm going to just pin this hair out the way. Okay, so I already did this, these pieces in the back. Um, I didn't take much off, but now I'm going to show you how I did it. Just clip this out the way. Take a small piece. Alright, you're going to comb the hair. Follow with your fingers to, to right before the damaged ends. It's about there. Then you're going to just trim that off. And there you go. Comb that out. And then you're going to want to take the other side, take another small piece, because you want your hair to be even, you're working up to the front of your head in twos, in the two sections. And cut. Okay. Then you're gonna take both sides, kind of measure that they're about equal, which they are. You're gonna tuck it away with the other hair you cut. And you're gonna do the same thing for the rest of your head. Okay, so I have finished trimming my hair. And as you can see, it's pretty even. And it still has a lot of length. Um, I took off about an inch because I had some really bad ends. Oh my gosh. But I did notice when I was doing it that this part here was not as damaged as like the back and the rest of the hair. So whatever that's worth. Who knows. But let me show you the back. 